Okay, here we go. Let's def defend. Defend. I, I'll have no problem now completing the main objective, but it's destroying the pirate ships. Which one's Jack? Oh, he's running. You, di you didn't know we could shoot back, did you? Is that Jack there? Which one's Jack? That's right, pirates. Oh, we're sinking a ship. One of them's sinking, I think. Yep, that one looks like it's sinking. Yeah, Jack is defeated. You've defeated Jack Torpedo. Now the surrounding waters will be saved. Damn right. Bounty for... De Whoa, we got 6,000 money for that? Woo! You know, I was recently playing Microsoft Flight Simulator, the new one, and it brought me back to thinking about the days of Microsoft Flight Simulator where you had to fly a rescue mission or a drop-off mission at an oil rig. And here in Drill Deal, we're going to be building our very own oil rig and selling all of that oil for juicy, juicy money. Hello again there, friends and fans. Raptor here, and welcome to Drill Deal. This game available now on Steam is in a alpha state, and it's quite cool. It's actually a vos voxel-based like management building simulator for building an oil rig and uh, bringing on all the employees and dealing with their uh, needs and wants and whatnot. Keep them happy, keep them safe on the oil rig, and of course to make many a thing that'll make us many a money. Well, if you like money, make sure you go ahead and click or tap that like button to let me know you'd like to see more of this. And of course to support the channel as always and welcome to all of those new subscribers. You guys are subbing all the time making sure you never miss out on more. So let's go ahead and start with some drill deal. I've already played through the tutorial a bit. It covers most of what there is to learn, but of course a lot of what you'll be doing is learned throughout the missions. So there's many different areas to go, including a sandbox mode, which is cool. We'll eventually be able to upgrade and build our uh, little oil rig even bigger. So let's go ahead and expand your oil rig in pirate waters. Oh, that's great. All right, let's go ahead and get started here. Ah. Expand your oil rig in the pirate waters. Manage our company's new investment. It is a platform in the tropical climate. These waters are calm except for Captain Jack Torpedo, who has recently begun exporting ransom on nearby ships. Oh, well that's great, so we'll have to watch out for pirates then, pirating uh, ships, so we'll have to see what we can do. This game looks really neat, actually. What is this all garbage here? What is all this, like, weird colored stuff? That's strange. What is that? Uh, let's see. Main objective. Achieve platform level 6. Defeat Captain Jack Torpedo and produce and sell 200 of asphalt. Wow, look at all the stuff we can make in this game. All these things on the left side is all the different types of fuels that we can produce or products that require oil and then additionally things like meal and food and whatnot that the employees will require in order to stay on board the oil rig. Build more buildings to raise your platform level. Build heavy oil refining plant to produce asphalt. You got it. All right, let's go ahead and get started then. Let's go ahead and pause here and take a look around in this game a little bit. It certainly is beautiful, I must say. Uh, this is the area that we're permitted to build. Is that like an old sea mine or something like that? That's going to be dangerous. And look, an uh, old sunken uh, aircraft too that went nose down into the water. At least I think. Is that the tail? No, that's a, that's like a buoy. Never mind. I thought that was like a plane that nose dived. Okay. Well, we've got ourselves a few islands nearby, and uh, this is our oil rig here, where we'll assign employees to start drilling for us, and of course we'll have to keep them on board too, and this over here is where things will be shipped out. Is there actually a way to rotate? There sure is. Cool. Q&E to rotate, WSD for camera controls, basic stuff. All right, let's go ahead and start building things, so that way we can uh, get all of our employees going. So, what we'll need to do is create asphalt. So, what does asphalt require in order to build? They did say that we needed to make ourselves the, uh, what was it, the, some sort of a heavy plant? Let's see, gas plant, water purifier, ooh, wind generator for power generation. We also have ourselves a gas generator, which takes gas in order to uh, power it as well. So we might be able to build one of these here to make gas. So it looks like that takes crude oil and then produces fuel and oil or heavy oil or gasoline. So that must be what they mean by gas. So we'll need a basic refinery to take the oil and turn it into power for us. So let's get started with that stuff. Let's go ahead and plop that down right over meow. And, of course, it'll build as soon as uh, a lot of that uh, on-pausing takes place. Is there a way to rotate objects? I don't think so. There probably is. But let's go ahead and just plop that down there, too. Okay, so our power is taken care of. Let's go ahead and start with our next thing, which will be the uh, basic employee quarters. We'll build that on the other side. Area here for the employees to stay. A canteen for them to uh, have some meals at. And also a small kitchen in order to produce those meals. And we'll also need a cold storage, too. Congratulations! Your oil rig has achieved level 2. You gain 2 reputation. All right, let's unpause. I'm tired of the cutting noise. Okay, let's try to put down a... Uh, we also need cold storage for food. So where is that found under? Here it is, the cooler. Increases storage space for meals and cooking ingredients. So we'll go ahead and have to plop one of those down, too. Very nice. 
Okay. Oh, it looks like storage area. It's a building blocks container. So water, refined crude oil, that type of thing. Very nice. Okay, let's see what else we've got uh, under this next menu. What, what, is that a basketball court? A small gym. Wow, okay. All sorts of things for our employees to keep them happy. All right, we're going to have to get some employees on board. Oh, look, there's like a manta ray zipping around too. That's cool. All right, we're definitely going to need some employees here. So let's go ahead and hire uh, cheap, you know, because we're, we're cheap and all that. So let's go ahead and do 40, 53, 36. We'll start with three people here to get things rolling. Let's go ahead and have somebody to operate the drill during the day shift. Let's go ahead and have, uh, eh, let's see, Aiden's fine for that. Let's go ahead and put Aiden on the day shift. Let's go ahead and put somebody in the kitchen. Who do we have here at effectiveness of cooking? Uh, let's see. Eh, we'll have Caleb do it. He doesn't seem to be the best at it, but that's fine. We'll go ahead and have him do something. And then somebody over here at the uh, basic refinery. Let's go ahead and have Aiden on that, I guess, as well. Oh, actually, here. Cooking, drilling, uh, entertainment, and security. Okay. So let's just go ahead and start with something. That's their extra skills, but sometimes it's based on who is uh, available at the time. All right. So we got the oil rig working. We are now in the night cycle. Let's take a look here at what else we can build. That'll be useful. Oh, what is this? A bridge. Ah, it connects platforms. So we can have more than one platform operating. This game is going to be super complicated. What do you guys think of the voxel art of the game? I really like games that have voxel art, especially, for example, uh, Industries of Titan. Any sort of game that's like a city builder. I really like that a lot. All right. We got three out of seven employees. And uh, we need a little bit more power than we're producing, but things are getting running there. And, of course, we're on the night shift, so I suppose we probably should hire some more employees. Then we're going to need all hands on deck then for this one. Okay, let's see what else we've got in our options menu. Uh, we have our current employees. We have business deals, but we're not making anything that we need at the moment. And uh, technology tree. Ah, plenty of things to unlock in this game, too. Excellent. I want to kind of do a full series on this one. So what do you guys think about doing a full series? Do you think that'd be cool? I certainly would like to. It looks like these need to be connected. Although there was nothing in the tutorial about creating uh, pipelines to connect things, but it might also be because they're not actually functioning and so they don't have the thing. The, like the oil drill is not functioning, so thus this can't get the crude oil, which can't create the gas, so there's like nothing going on, which is fine. It's just nighttime. It's, it's fine. It's fine. It, it, this, is, it, it, this, this is fine. Ordering supplies. When we, uh, food or ingredients are low, order them from the orders panel. Okay, you got it. All right. Well, what do we have for food now, actually? It looks like we have uh, some small meals. Oh, actually, we're making meals from ingredients okay and orders are here so i guess we can order some mcdonald's or something let's get let's get takeout let's do some uh ingredients here uh what are we ordering 50 oh, wow Ooh, the cost is very expensive wow okay uh let's see i guess we'll order just a small amount we will need some we'll get started with just a small just a little bit of delivery go ahead and confirm that and that'll be on the way shortly all right looks like the drill is working power's coming in excellent everything's going according to plan to which we have none. Yes, that's right. All right, what's the workshop do? Maintenance building, working on repairs in nearby buildings. I see. Ah, we have helipads, too, just like what I was mentioning before with the Microsoft Flight Simulator, being able to land and, you know, drop people off and drop off supplies and pick up things and bring them back for repair. Good. Very good. All right, so our research is going to have to unlock that thing that creates uh, asphalt. So what way do we need to go for asphalt? Advanced drilling. There it is, right down there. So we need to do basic oil production to which we can actually unlock some of that stuff. So basic rig, let's go down that way. Excellent, basic rig production unlocked. So now we can start selling some uh, basic stuff here. So we're gonna wanna be able to produce chemicals and then eventually start producing asphalt. So hopefully we can go down that line soon. Ah, oh, the boat is here, check that out. That's cool. Very nice. Wow, the boat looks really weird, all those different colors. Oh, these games with day-night cycle. That looks dangerous, what's going on? My goodness. All right, let's put some more people to work on the night shifts. Let's go ahead and make sure we got nonstop crude oil production. Who else do we have who's good on who's good on drill? Let's put Luke on there. And let's go ahead and put uh, somebody on to uh, basic refinery, I suppose, for nighttime. Uh, let's see. Who would be good for refining? Well, Christopher is the only one available now. So let's put him on the night shift so we're continuously producing gas. And I think the electric generator works automatically. So, so long as we're doing that, gasoline is being produced right there maybe we can get some contracts for export let's try that who wants to buy some gas india trans wants to buy gas all right you can set the daily amount of products to send well let's see what do we have at the moment we have 352 on gas uh we have crude oil maxed out and gasoline and they want uh actually that's kind of misleading there's gas and gasoline so it looks like they actually determine gasoline with the barrel and gas is in like natural gas is the little flame so that makes sense so let's send what's our daily amount can we type in I don't think I can send or type in. 
Let's see, overall cargo is 310. So let's send like uh, maybe 100? Let's send like 105. Let's sign a deal for that one. Good. Now we'll make some money. Excellent. So they'll be here soon. Okay, looks like we need some more storage for things. So crude oil is definitely getting backed up. Let's store crude over here. Entertainment buildings. Make your employees happy. Build entertainment buildings such as a cinema or gym. Okay, we'll get to that shortly. All right, let's put crude oil storage there. And that's good. And let's try to build something to keep our people happy. So we've got food and stuff there. A lot of this stuff is unlocked, so we got to go for entertainment one. So under... Employee care. Ew, gross. An expense for a corporation? Disgusting. You're responsible for your own happiness, not the corporation. How dare you? You're interfering with profit. Let's see. Increase the time needed for... Oh, yes. Excellent. Uh, let's build a entertainment building then. We'll start with a little cinema there. We're spending money like crazy. We've only got 72, but I guess these are things that are needed to keep everyone happy. Let's see here. Uh, where's the cinema? Canteen. There it is. $400 is what we need, so we'll go and do some export of uh, crude oil here shortly. Actually, gas is what we're making. We probably should see how much we're storing now. 258 259 279 Oh, we're making a lot of that. Very good. We need more gas storage, too. Let's see. We got crude oil storage up to 1,000. Gas, we could probably store some of that, too. Maybe we could do another contract. Let's see. Who else can we sign a deal with? We have uh, crude oil. Uh, Perto wants to purchase some of that. Let's go ahead and make a deal with them, too. We'll sell a little bit of that for a few days here. Good. Very good. Let's make that money, baby. All right, those boats should be here soon. How are the employees doing? Oh, they look highly motivated. You can't really tell. They're just pixels. But still, let's let's just pretend. Excellent. Good. Very good. Wow, the day-night cycle in this game. I wish it was just day all the time. I don't need the night cycle. Let's see. Contracts tree. Oh, we can unlock additional contracts, too. Ah, and it looks like there is a company that will purchase asphalt, so we'll be able to get a, a ton of money from that. A plenty, plenty of cash. Plenty of cash. All right, let's speed up time. Times four while we wait for our contracts to come in and products to go out. Good. Very good. Wow, there's lots of crude oil sitting here. A lot of it being uh, put into the gas. Excellent. Okay, we're going to need more money for storage. Repair your buildings. Okay, we definitely need to do that. It looks like they degrade over time, so we'll have to build ourselves a little workshop. That'll cost us five hundo. So we're going to need quite a bit of cash. You can see it's very expensive to operate these. Got to get a lot of basic stuff just to keep the employees happy. And hopefully we'll have ourselves a shipment coming in here soon. Is that a Kraken? What is that? Whoa. Okay, no thank you. I want nothing to do with that. Anything else around here? Looks like we can actually build all the way out there, too. You can kind of see where it's a little darker. It might be hard to see at nighttime like this, but you can kind of see everything going on. All right. Can we take out a little loan, maybe? I, I need some extra cash to keep our employees happy. And I wonder where that uh, ship is, by the way. Oh, there we go. We made some money now, finally. Watch out for Jack Torpedo. Nearby waters are plagued. There we go. Uh, with the terrible pirate, the management will unlock a turret building technology if we see pirates to it attack too often. Ooh, all right, we can put down turrets to defend to defend the oil rig. Okay, that's interesting. Let's go ahead and make sure that they don't attack. All right, everybody's sad, I know. Uh, the amount of miss missing basic buildings too. It's good to have a workshop and a cinema. It certainly is, but it's also good to have money as we'll need that for our contracts. Let's see what other contracts we can sign. Ooh, looks like our daily target is uh, 390 on these. Oh, it's the daily target. We should be able to hit these. Look, we're maxed out on gasoline and crude oil. Good. Very good. Ah, quick contracts. Ah, good. Well, let's sell some of these. Excellent. Ah, so that's how we can make some quick money. By selling some things we already have in storage. Ah, I see. Good. Very good. Now we have some extra cash. Okay, let's build that workshop. And let's build that cinema. Good. Congratulations, you're now level three. Good, I didn't know about the small contracts, and now I do, and I'm really happy about that. Very, very good. Muy bueno, in fact. All right, let's see if we can hire some more people. Let's go for some cheapies. Good, because this is just going to be for a day shift at a, a workshop and a cinema. Actually, I don't even think you need to do that. Ah, oh, looks like this guy would be better at the cinema. Hold on, does anyone need to work there? Ah, yeah, small cinema. Let's put him into... Uh-oh, what's going on? Yeah, let's put this person into entertainment and get somebody else on the workshop. 
All right. Byron, you'll do just fine. All right, we have maximum employees. We need to produce a little bit more power now. So let's do that. Another small gas generator there. Good. All right, now everyone should be able to go to the cinema and get happy again. Excellent. And uh, big contract should be done shortly. Wow, look at that. The uh, storm is actually like complete. Wow, it's hitting the bottom. Look at this giant storm going on. It's actually swallowing up all the islands. Holy crap. Oh, wow. It's. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, are we going to get hit by lightning and explode? Is there, oh, is there going to be a huge fire? Uh oh. What's going on? Okay, we need to bring in some more money. Let's let's store some more of this stuff. We need. Oh, we actually need. Um, requires more resources. Does that mean money? Hmm. Doesn't look like it actually requires money at all. It requires building blocks. 20. Ah, so we need to order some of those. Building blocks. Okay, let's order. How are we doing on food ingredients? Let's order a little bit of food ingredient. Let's see here. Let's order. Like a, f a few of those and a few building blocks. This will be 255. Ah, there we go. We got some money from our contract. And contract complete. Excellent. Uh, let's see. Jack Torpedo is here. Uh-oh. He wants to uh, booty us down. Denied. Ready for a fight. We're not actually, but I want to see what happens. Oh, we don't have enough money for this. No. Hold on. Let's see. What oh, boy. Pirates are attacking. Let's see what happens. They're just shooting everywhere. Um, okay. Oh, boy. Oh, wow, they're damaging a lot of stuff. Jack's landing strikes on the uh, oil rig. I don't think we have enough money or power or research to build the turrets. How would, What would that be under? Where are those turrets? Let's see. Energy production. Maybe maintenance security. There it is. Unlocks with a thousand cash. Wow. See, you are no match for me. Next time pay and I will... Okay, well... He caused some damage, but actually things are okay. Pfft, what a sucky pirate. Next time we'll be ready for him. Let's build a turret and get ready. Okay, let's do some more big O contracts. Let's see. What else can we deliver? It looks like we're doing a, a good deal there. What if we can do this one? Let's try to deliver more gasoline. We'll make a let's try to make a thousand cash on that one now that we understand the deals a bit better. And we can sell the gas right off for some extra cash. Good. And let's start with that research. We don't want to get attacked again. So let's do security. Good. Excellent. Now we'll probably have to buy some more building blocks to properly build our security tower. Let's see. Where is that? Defense tower. There it is. So it'll require 50 plus another 100 lubricants. So we'll need to produce some lubricants now. And we'll probably need some more employees, too. It looks like we're maxed out. We'll need some more crew quarters. That will require uh, 600 bucks. So we'll need a little bit more cash for that. Good. Soon. Contracts. When you want to sell new re oh, thank you. Oh, good. Big money from that. When you want to sell new resources to companies, unlock new contracts. True. We don't have any new contracts really to, or uh, resources to do, but that's fine. Let's build another crew quarters. Basic employee quarters. Let's build that. And can I rotate? It looks like I can't build it there. Oh, they did destroy the uh, one building there, the little kitchen. That's fine. Oh, this is weird. This is like a little too large. I don't see a button to actually rotate buildings. There must be a way to do it. Scroll wheel. Ah, whatever. Let's just place it there. We'll put more crew buildings on this side and building stuff on the other side. Good. Good. All right, now we can hire more employees. Let's do it. We need to make some more money. And hiring more people will allow us to do that. And let's build ourselves that... Uh... Ah, we can't build a canteen just yet. I mean, a kitchen... So we'll just wait on that. They've destroyed the kitchen, my favorite building. How dare they? How dare they? Luckily, we have plenty of meals for now, so that's okay. We also have a good amount of water for now, so that's fine. Looks like we've also produced a lot of heavy oil. You know what would be nice is if it auto-sold anything, if you could do an auto-sell of stuff that you're just not using. That would be a good feature. Like, for example, we're not really using gas at the moment, so it's always a good idea just to sell those. Probably not a great deal to sell it immediately, but it's a good way to keep things going. Wow, look at all the cash we're making now, baby. Woo! Okay, let's do some more crude oil contracts. Let's try to sell some of those. There we go. Now, do we have somebody... Uh-oh, Jack is back. Deny his request again. Uh, the management unlocks turret to help with the problem. What? I already paid for it. Oh, man. Oh, man. Management will automatically unlock it for free? I got scammed. You jerks. Well, you unlocking it is one thing, but I need to purchase lubricants. 
And it doesn't look like there's any way to do that, so we actually have to make it ourselves. De defense turret, you want to shoot Jack? Uh, oh, 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 we got to have somebody. Do we, do we have to assign somebody? Wait, no. Defense tower, press off to activate shooting mode. Wait, what? Press off? Wait, what? What do you mean? I, I lack critical information. Press off to activate. What? There's a, is there a switch? Where is it? What? No! Jack, Jack, I didn't know how to turn on my gun. That's not fair. <laughs> no! You swindler, Jack. I'll get you. Press off. Is there a button? Where's the button? Oh, over here. Oh, oh, I'm supposed to do my... Okay. Oh, I will... Okay, that was just... Pra okay. Again, we're, we're, we're luring him in, into a false sense of security. Yeah, that's, that's right. Yeah, that's my excuse. That's right. Okay, we're gonna need a small cinema. Honestly, at this rate, we have tons of money, so it really doesn't matter. We got plenty of food ingredients. We have somebody working at the can the kitchen, right? We have a kitchen working, okay. Okay. Uh, what could I do next? We've got plenty of employees. Are we producing asphalt? Zero out of 100. Oh, oh, oh uh, my bad. Okay, that's how the gun works. Okay, there it is. Okay, let's see. Day shift, we need to assign somebody. Brian, you're on asphalt duty, my man. And let's have somebody produce at nighttime, too, so we can get out of here. All right, go ahead, Jack. Try to attack us one more time. Fool. He's a fool. How much do we have for gasoline? 322. We should be producing enough power. We're producing three, 240 out of 310. Maybe it's because this doesn't have somebody working here? Mm, I should hire some more employees, but I think we're also out of space for that. Mm, I can't squeeze any more in. All right, let's turn off the uh, let's turn off the nighttime shift and get somebody on the cinema for the daytime shift. That'll be fine. This is not optimized, but at least it's getting the job done. I'm just trying to get out of here as quick as possible with Jack constantly attacking. Okay, let's make an order of... Uh, what do you guys want from uh, Burger King? You guys like Burger King? No? What do you like? Max? Max C Max Crispy Fries. Yes. Hmm. Do we have cold storage? I don't know. Oh, we can actually order big a big tanker worth of stuff. Well, order me some building blocks. I don't want these to be a problem anymore. It looks like we can only hold 200. So let's order uh, maybe 50 just to kind of like... Okay, that's fine. And then... I'm going to order some food just so we're good to go. we got plenty of cash, so let's do that now. Oh, everybody's unhappy. How does the cinema not have uh, power? I wonder if we need to build the power closer to the bill. Oh, perfect. Let's deny Jack's request. Let's ready for fight. Oh, dude. I can retire now as a mediocre at best YouTuber. Some of you are yelling at your screen. I was actually a man of action. Not a man of a plan, but a man of action. And that action caused regret for all the families who allowed their people to be sent to this uh, weird little oil rig. All right. How much do we have for asphalt yet? 75? Okay, we need to start selling 200. So let's do a contract to get rid of some of that. So let's upgrade our contracts. So let's go up this way. We'll just go straight for the asphalt contract. That's our main goal. Thank you. Oh, wait. Oh, I've scammed. It was actually that way. That's fine. We got plenty of cash. It's all good. Actually, now with all these extra contracts, we can probably sell whatever we need to. This opens way more doors. Because now, because of this way, I can sell some of that heavy oil, which I usually have a lot of extra. And this also, I can sell heavy oil. So we got multiple options for contracts. Ooh, good. It looks like we just need a little bit more cash. So let's do some more deals. Let's sell a little heavy oil. Uh, I don't think we have any of this. Sulfur, right? Solid fuel. Uh, let's sell regular fuel. Fuel oil. Let's sell, let's sell just a little, little bit of everything. Just a little bit. It's a little bit of everything. Got our people working hard. Sign all these contracts now. Good. Let's do a... Uh, let's see, do we want to sell some gasoline? I don't mind that. And let's sell some... Well, gas and gasoline is what we need to sell. Gas and gasoline being sold now. Confirmed. All right, let's unlock that last line there. 3,600 implemented, and we are good to go. Okay, let's make that our final contract now. We need to sell that asphalt. There it is. So we need to sell 200... So, how do I, like, select 200? Uh, uh, you can... Daily amount. Um, oh, boy. Let's see. We want to sell... 
sell 200. Oh, maybe we should do 100 a day. Now let's just do 200 to make sure we're there. Okay, 203. That's enough. Good. All right, do we have somebody working here day and night? Okay, we should have a day and night person working here. Brian Smith, you're on it. Let's go. All right, there we go. 200 asphalt sold. One last thing now to upgrade the uh, oil rig to level 6. So let's slow her down. We can basically just kind of cancel all the production and stuff going on to get this last goal. Let's get some things out of the way. Build ourselves another uh, cinema here to get those levels up. These are rookie numbers. we got to increase those numbers. So we'll go ahead and get some uh, cinemas up here. So that way we can then uh, hire some people to work. That should increase our level. So we got somebody free. And uh, another person free, I'm sure. Where we go? There we go. Jeremiah. There you go. All right. Let's see if the uh, rig gets up to a level six now. We're at level five. We just need one more. Uh, let's see. Your reputation improving. Reputation improves available contracts. That's not related. But we do need to upgrade to level, level six. Almost there. Jack is destroyed. Asphalt is sold. Now we got to just make this into a party boat. It's going to be nice. All right. Let's see what else we can do to increase people's happiness we got ourselves meals good food ingredients we're making a lot of food there at the kitchen let's see let's unlock some more fun stuff for the ship let's go down here employee care let's unlock simple bedrooms Ooh, that increases the number of employees we can have good ah let's unlock the gym and the cinema upgrade that'll be good all right let's do that let's upgrade the cinema so let's see, that requires, oh, it allows another person to work here. Okay, and then that allows us to destroy this one. And let's build ourselves a gym. Whoever gym is, I don't know, but we'll put it down and see how it goes. Excellent. Ah, we can do nighttime stuff too. Excellent. Good entertainment. All right, there we go. Oh, wait, somebody's got to work at the gym? Well, you all should work at the gym. Like, you know, working out at the gym. Ah, good, we completed our contract there. All that stuff is finished. The asphalt all done. Let's take everyone off the jet. Let's take off a nighttime shift and make it a daytime shift at the old, the old gym. All right, that should increase our rating now. We should have enough stuff here. Let's keep unlocking stuff. Oh, you know, we can get rid of the gun, but it actually doesn't take up any space. So let's keep going. Employees. Basic employees. More employees. Skilled employees. Hmm. Let's see. Oh, it looks like some of these are blocked for now. We can actually upgrade the gym. That's about the end of that line. Production doesn't really need to be upgraded. Maintenance. Oh, security. A lot of dead ends here at the beginning. We're not able to get everything yet in the game. Basic employees, though. We could try to get some more people here. And we should be able to upgrade the bedrooms. Maybe we can get more people on board. Let's see. Requires more resources and looks like we're short on some cash. Need a little bit of money, then. Let's see. What could we sell? Pretty much everything, I guess. We're just holding on to way too much. I can't expand at the moment, so that's a pain. Let's just sell a little bit of everything. Make some money from that, there we go. Close to a hundo, a little bit over, that's fine. There we go. Good, 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 and good. All right, let's get this thing running. And there we go, boys, woo, we did it. All right, I had to upgrade a few buildings and I I, I, I did it. We got more employees here, and everything worked out pretty good. All right, guys, that is it for this game for now. It is just the prologue, available kind of in an early access. So add it to your Steam wish, wish list if you're curious, and I will see you guys next time for more. Thanks for that positivity in chat. Thanks very much for suggesting other games, and uh, I just... You guys are great. Thanks for being the best community on YouTube. Let me know what you think about this game, the voxel art and whatnot. Pop open that comment section and say hi, and I will heart your comment, too. You guys are awesome. I'll see you next time. Goodbye. Seesaw? You hear it? it it's a saw cutting. And we're at sea. It's a seesaw.